forgot to load the textures. Okay, there we go. <laughs> ah! It's like I'm playing it on a PS2. What's going on? There we go. Alright, what am I... What am I doing? Maybe I should go up to the suit. Aha! Oh boy. This is crazy. Don't worry, it'll work. Just make sure it's all bunched together with the structure gel connecting all the parts. Alright, try activating the suit from the terminal again. Oh god. Alright. D. I can't believe we're doing this. It will be fine. Then why don't we put you in the suit? I was going to suggest that if you refused. You go without me. I need to do this, Simon. <laughs> this is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it, change body. Yes, if you want to stay here, I'm not going to stand in your way. I don't want to tell you what to do. What would it be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right. Let's do it. Thank you, Simon. Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. Oh, boy. Uh, how did I get my username? It's, a. Uh, it started as, uh, I think it was like Scyther or something. I... I first thought it up when I played Final Fantasy 7 back in the day because I was like, oh my god, I can name my character. And then over time I just kind of shortened it because I realized that Scyther was like the exact same name as a Pokemon and I didn't want to use it. loop back the activity manifested by your current Cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip, and then make sure it's synced. You lost me halfway there. I... You don't really need to understand it. Just make them line up. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. I almost got it. Something's just slightly off. Oh, that's the one I need. This one's right. I'm pretty sure that the one on the on the right is right. So it's these two I gotta fiddle with until I get it. That's everything. You cool. can climb into the pilot seat now. Already? I have everything under control. So please have a seat. Is that the jar? Go sit in the pilot seat. <laughs> alright, alright, I'll quit stalling. Here we go. Sorry about any discomfort. This should be over soon. It's like having a picture taken. It's like, it's like Star Trek Online hacking. You know, Indians thought photos would steal their souls. In this case, they'd be right. Uh -huh. I can still turn my flashlight on. Okay. There must be something wrong. Can't you run a diagnosis or something? What was that? I had a feeling this would happen. No, I, it's just... Why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works, you know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. You were copied. The sleeping Simon in the seat was copied, and now you are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. God damn it. Kath, two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That you were going to take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain no. transplant. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset you. How did you expect me to react to this shit? Please stop. You're fucking disgusting. 
What's gonna happen to him? He'll sleep for a while, a few days. And then what? Wake up in his fucking nightmare again? All alone? That's so cruel. Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? What if... What if he didn't need to wake up? You'd do that? I don't know. Maybe. There. I set it up for you. Hit the switch if you want to drain his battery. He'll die within a minute. I'd rather not stay plugged in any longer. What switch? Oh. But I was giving him presents. Here you go, friend. You'll always be my favorite, Simon. Yeah, I'm gonna kill him. He'll never- he never needs to know that this happened. And like what? He's just gonna wake up and then... do what? You are gonna die, right? Oh, yeah. Poor little guy. He had no future. There was nothing. There was nothing left for him in this place. Here, I have a boot. It's my shrine that I'm building to myself. Come here. Come here. Come here, goddammit. I will get this shit. Yeah. Haha! <laughs> Nailed it! <laughs> Have a nice non-life, Simon, you dick! Alright, let's get out of here. <laughs> uh, it's too fun. Yeah, I was wondering about that too, since like, all the... Well, I think it, it copies the data, it doesn't really move it. So it's it's like the swapper. Right? That's what this game's starting to remind me of now, the fucking swapper. Like, uh... Yeah, it just made a copy of everything. So he was still... Exactly as he was. I am. He is. We're going this way or the other way? Are there two d different directions to go? Don't do this to me, game. You know how much I hate this shit. Okay, what was that other direction? <laughs> Man, I hate when there's two different ways to go. The music is very ominous. Alright, I'm just gonna go down this one. Oh, never mind, I can't. Okay. It's good to know. That would have bugged me forever if I hadn't known. I just had to know. He wouldn't have. That, that other Simon wouldn't have even been able to go anywhere because we took the Omni tool. He would have been stuck inside that building with, like, uh, all the fucking angry murderous creatures. Why is my vision getting all fucked up? Oh, hello. Here we go. Are we done here? Yeah. Activate the Claro, please. Sure thing. Tell us that. Oh, hello there. Yeah, it would have been that would have been horrible. Yeah. I think I missed a step. What? Oh. Take a seat and we'll be 
Okay. It's like a roller coaster. Have we figured out what happens when we die yet? Is that even possible? Or there's some kind of afterlife. Do you think my place is taken? The real me died like a hundred years ago. Is there still room for me? And what about the Simon I killed at Omicron? What do you think, Catherine? Is there a heaven full Shit. of redundant copies of the same people? Is there someone up there who call me an imposter? Damn, dude. It's dumb luck, right? That I woke up in the right body. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right Simon. Christ. This is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind. Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Let me say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I can still feel how I did it, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? You're sad. I'd still be alone. No friends. No family. Why are you be so sad, game? Friends? I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have. Sit back down. <laughs> the fuck is that thing? Whoa. 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 What the shit? Okay, well that's cool. <laughs> hey, I know it's not much, but why have we stopped moving? The power blacked out for a moment. Think it could be the atmospheric pressure. 
It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry, it should hold. Comforting. It will hold. How do I restart this thing? Just sit down. Does does time freeze when you're not powered? Time feels omitted. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or hindered. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes. But generally, you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation, since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. It's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. That'd be the worst. Oh man, we passed the, uh, the second blue line. Things are about to get... Uh, God! Son of a bitch. What? What? No! You did it! You did it! I will make preparations. How come he didn't need a suit? What a dick. Oh, good, you're back. What? What happened? Something dropped onto the cage. Knocks you right out. It spoke to me. It looked like a man, one of WoW's creatures. It just stared at you for a moment, then threw itself down the abyss. It said it would make preparations. Like <laughs> what was that? that? Good question. Very strange. I thought it was Good question. Kill you for sure. Glad it didn't. Yeah. Me too. <laughs> Three thousand, four thousand meters. Like closing in on the ocean floor. Good. Not sure the climber can take it much longer. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the abyssal plan used by Pathos 2. I expect we'll have to do some walking before we reach town. Yeah, lovely. Not in a way that'll help us. Right, the author you has been here. We're following all footsteps, Cat. When I have footsteps. You could still be down here somewhere, technically. Don't remind me, freaks me out. Alright, let's head for town and find that arm. Yeah, what if we find the real Catherine? Like, what if she's still alive? What then? Which one deserves to go on the Ark? They're both the same person. Oh yeah, the door doesn't work. Oh, uh, maybe it does, the door does work. Oh! <laughs> Stupid future technology. Get out of the way. Can you take them both? How does that solve anything? That would just be weird. Well, this looks fucking promising. As in, this looks fucking awful. I don't know what this is, but it's green. Catherine Chun, Ian Peterson, Sarah Lindwall. Nikolai Ivushkin, Jasper Hill, bringing the Ark to Phi. Ellen Waldeck, remote. Hmm. Isn't that a bit hypocritical of her being freaked out by the thought of seeing herself down here? But not by the thought of two Simons. Yeah! <laughs> a little bit. It's in here. Tao. 
try the next one. It's like super dark down here. What's this? Uh, is there something I need in here? What? It's the storage shed, I guess. Bloop, 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 bloop. <laughs> Press this button? No. This is, this is darker than darkness. This is the darkening. that sound? Whoa! I don't know what that means, but I don't like it. Oh, dear God, that is a person. Stick to the lamp lights, they won't go near them. I can't, Valglasser. It's important I reach Omicron. Our future depends on it. Calm down. Let's just follow the path. If I die, I need you to tell Julia Dahl that the world is out of control. Great. She needs to get to Sarang. He'll know what to do. Raj, you can tell them yourself. We just need to pick up the pace, okay? Glass! We lost the path! We need to go back! I know where to go. Come on! It's over there! The light is over there! Final push, Ross. Almost there, we just... Ah! Ah! Dude got torn apart. Yeah, as, as I was editing the videos, I remembered that the the place we'd seen that giant, like chrome circley thing or orby thing before was in Sarang's room, which he was the dude who we thought. Uh, oh God. Okay. Blue leads to Tau, or at least to the climber. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, we thought he spread the WoW, or whatever, like he had those all those confidential files and a picture of that, uh, Orby thing, and people were calling it, like, Alpha, or whatever. So, like, maybe that's where this all started. Maybe it's, like, some kind of AI core of some sort. I can't tell if these lights are a color, or if they're just white. Over here. <laughs> All right, fuck this shit. Let's go. I'm just gonna sprint. Where the fuck am I gonna hide? So 
Something's happening! Whoop! Shit! <laughs> I didn't expect that. Inventory. Go as ostrich and just stick my head in the dirt. Mission logs. Observation 134. Dried squid. Oh, frilled shark. Great. Humpback whale. I don't know what this means. Squid. Anglerfish. Gravy. Can you go down there? Holy schniz. Alright. It's so loud. I guess I was supposed to go in here. I'm just gonna follow this, whatever this is. Ah, oh, fuck. Alright, never mind then. Why does this sound like a thunderstorm? Alright, just keep following the lights, I guess. Thank God these glow sticks aren't going anywhere. It's back here. This is freaking me out. Oh, dude, what? What is all this nonsense? Uh-oh. The surface of the planet from alien isolation? I never did make it to the planet part. <laughs> I didn't even know there was a planet. Oh god. Let's leave that there for now, since I don't know what I'm doing. Ah. Tau, can you hear this? Anyone there? This is Tau? Who is this? This is Ian Peterson of Beta calling. I got a team with me, and we're about half a kilometer from Tau. What? How, how did... You came in the climber? Listen. We're having a really hard time with this sector. Heavy turbulence is making it difficult to move forward, and the wildlife you've got is absolutely rabid. The storm comes and goes. The instruments show the weather is relatively fair right now. You should move out as soon as possible. Stick to the lights. The critters should leave you alone. Great. All right, you heard the man. We're moving out, people. Tao, keep the doors unlocked. We're coming in. So stick to the lights.
<laughs> so why do I have this thing? Status. Unable to retrieve data. 